Good morning, crypto family. Hope you guys are having a great morning. Time to be blessed. No time to be stressed. Go ahead and start, you know, stacking them digits up. Now, it seems like the government is after us. They don't want us to become wealthy. But let me get straight to it. As you guys see here, public service announcement. Alert on cryptocurrency money services businesses. The FBI warns Americans against using cryptocurrency money transmitting services that are not registered as money service business. According to United States federal law and do not adhere to anti-money laundering requirements. A few simple steps can prevent unintentional use of non-compliant services. For example, avoid cryptocurrency money transmitting services that do not collect know your customer information from customers when required now <clears throat> so you guys can send crypto to overseas and now you're calling cryptocurrency money come on make it make sense so this is why i made that post yesterday it's about to go down okay because not as prices i mean yeah we may have a little decline or whatnot but it's gonna go crazy up all right so this is what they're saying the fbi had the fbi has recently conducted law enforcement operations against cryptocurrency services which were not licensed in accordance with federal law people who use unlicensed cryptocurrency money transmitting services may encounter financial disruptions during law enforcement actions especially if their cryptocurrency is intermingled with funds obtained through illegal means okay risky services cryptocurrency money transmitting services that pur purposely break the law or knowingly facilitate illegal transactions will be investigated by law enforcement using a service that does not comply with its legal obligations may put you at risk of losing access to funds after law enforcement operations target those businesses. It's getting crazy. It's getting crazy. This is what happens when you're about to head to the top. This is the type of shit you deal with when you're about to head to the top, but it ain't shaking none, ain't scaring none. Shout out to Ash Crypto. He says this, bull market strategy. We did accumulation in 2023. We are holding in 2024. We will do distribution in 2025. Reminder, continue profit booking and starting a bull market is poor strategy. We call it opportunity loss. Whoever sold their coin in the last six months are in opportunity loss as of now. Target time, not a price. Profit time, having plus year. We will sell blow off top mid 2025. Family. And listen, man, I'm a, I'm a, of course, like what I told you guys, I will be selling a percentage of Doge Long, you know, because I need to, I need, I need to have some money, you know what I'm saying? But other than that, I'm holding the rest of my percentage on my portfolio because I'm gonna ride this thing all the way up. Now, Balaji, he says they have, they also devalue the dollar by 25 percent. Inflation plus taxation equal confiscation now you heard you heard what the fbi is doing you know that cryptocurrency is going to like we're going to explode they're throwing fear in a lot of people there's some people there are a lot of people who are scary they're very scary and they'll you know they'll shake out and be like you know i don't want nothing to do with cryptocurrency i want to be done with it let them be them all right so as you guys see here <clears throat> let's let's say you build a business from scratch and you qualify for Biden's new 25% unrealized gains tax. So you have to sell 25% of your business to pay the tax, but now you have to pay 44.6% cap gains plus 13.3% on that. So you actually have to sell 37% of your business. That's crazy. The inflation is going crazy, family. So, you know, you have to, you know, with our investments and what we're doing now, it's smart that we hopped in and not doing nothing stupid, 
but we will prevail over all that crap. So as you guys see, Meta Planet, a Japanese company, has purchased 6.25 million of Bitcoin recently. Japanese yen went to zero against Bitcoin. Giga bullish, as you guys see right here. All right. Now, with that being said, like everything that I've been reading out to you guys, this is why I hold digital assets. This is why I accumulate a whole bunch of Deutsche Lamar Mars. Okay. Dollar cost averaging. I mean, I'm I'm still up, even though I'm down in my portfolio. I bought in the highs when it first came out. Not when it first came out, I bought real low, but I started buying more in November, October of 2021. But I'm like, I'm like, you know, I'm not gonna fall for the FBI playing their tactics on people. Why is these companies in different countries? are buying so much Bitcoin. Why is so much other financial institutions are not just buying Bitcoin, they're buying multiple digital assets. So, you know, I like to keep it like that and keep it grave and keep it moving, you know. But uh, like what I said, it's about to go down. Shout out to um, Mario JRT. So I never swap micro cap tokens. I feel that is stupidity, my opinion. As you guys see right now, we're sitting at 2,000 down 0.40% at Dogelon. Okay. Now, if you guys seen that post with the, uh, Jeremy Da Vinci, he made a reel on Instagram and he was talking about if you should put $100 into Bitcoin or $100 into meme coins. And the meme coins that he had up there was Dogelon, Pepe, uh, Doge Long, Pepe, Doge, and some other coin. Come on. Why would he put those tokens? No one has been really talking about Doge Long Mars, but he had Doge Long Mars up there. Like when I made that one video with the, uh, Jeremy Da Vinci about well, a couple months ago, he holds Doge Long. Don't let them play these little games with you guys saying, oh, well, you know, you, you could take a risk and invest in meme coins or just, I know that $100 is going to go a long way in Bitcoin. Don't let them play them games with you like that. Listen, if you're going to invest in Bitcoin, invest in Bitcoin. If you're going to grab you some bags of meme coins, grab you some bags of meme coins. But I'm not playing no little games. I'm like, well, you know, you have to choose. No, nah, this is not no Captain Planet. We're going to choose what we're going to get. You know what I'm saying? And Obviously, we've been holding Doge Line. Most of you guys hold other digital assets, but I ain't shaking none. And, you know, that's about it right now. So I appreciate you guys tapping in, locking in with me. I got to go into work today. If I do drop another video, I probably have a video already ready. But if not, you guys know what time it is. Peace out, family. You guys have a great day.